like to now recognize the Wolves of Winter as an official guild of Evermore. Thank you for coming to our town council meeting. If you could please remember, it's very challenging if multiple people are speaking at once, so we do ask that you keep your conversations to a minimum. If you need to continue speaking, we ask that you leave the building. Thank you. We have gathered to our town council meeting to discuss the growing situation with the Frost Lords and the attack on Wolf Trust regarding Spani. And I wanted to make sure that everyone had, had spoken their piece. So I believe that there are individuals that would like to present information. Uh, yes. Uh, I personally would like to push for uh, the approval of the town council to arrest Lord Swan Lafer for the attempted murder and assault of the Ulfdorad of the Open Winter. I would not have done this myself, well, I would have done this myself earlier, but uh, given the circumstances of the potency of his magic, the rest of the town would be in danger were I to do so. So I wanted to get the approval of the entire town council before we moved. And any concerns that might be brought up that need to be addressed. Uh, making a move on Spawn Lake there and still means that we got to deal with the Frost Guy. Yes, I was brought up by my knights as well. Um, so anyone who has a way of potentially handling that other than brute force? A couple of theories that I got, but... I can't think of anything to do with could we put Sylvie on a to sleep somehow oh, so that Sylvie she wouldn't be able to control the side of the town at the moment. yeah so that the, she wouldn't be able to control the frost giant to make an attack well, or somehow otherwise block we would her still have to get to her well uh, a point to that Svani would still be very much active at this point so unless we deal with them both at the same time I'm entirely sure how that would work. Do they share, do they share control? Could the, the Frost Lords, more amenable to our way of thinking, be. Yeah, you know, we have a suggestion over here. Miranda, uh, speak loud, Miranda. Sylviana is now an answer. There's a way to dampen her ability to control the Frost Science and the Sunlight Elves. If there's a system we can disrupt. What do you mean? We got to take care of it. And we are then the first person of this as well. We, everyone has liberated us and loved us. So we are, we are going to take care of this prospect. That's a, that's a big thing to do lives on the line like right that. Sure. You put your lives on the line for us. And they've already put their lives on the line for us. We, information has come to light that the Elves of Light were the perpetrators of the death of Svan Leifer originally. But they have provided evidence, and also the evidence of Swan Lafer's character, as we have all seen in town with our own eyes. We have not sought to press charges in this regard, and in fact, they have been very helpful. Well, that's your call, lady, man. The prosecution rests. <laughs> <laughs> You can leave. You can leave. Uh, well, this is the uh, case. Okay, come now, this isn't the court case. Okay? Please, very this is a serious matter, please. Koresh, do you have anything you would like to add to this? Yes, I would like to this. As far as uh, the threat of the frost giant, um, no better uh, people to handle an Aurora issue than an Aurora, yes? Yeah? That's okay. I just have to get a need to stay up there. <laughs> and the Mikko, sure. No, you as well, though, in case, yeah? We'll take care of it. Right. You're a roaring through and through, you know this. <laughs> That's the frost child you're taking care of. As far as... Be careful. Please be careful. Or don't. <laughs> All right. Right. Anything for Victor? No. If, they, if they don't succeed, we have to deal with the frost child. I hope they succeed. I agree with you. I don't think it has... Secondarily, <laughs> as far as the arrest of Svan Leif here, Reminder, please, hold your chatter, and if you cannot, leave the building. As is understood, the wolves have wanted to see the uh, head of Svanleifir and the other Frost Lords roll for quite some time now. 
We've yet stayed our blades, and with the much contention between us, we've, uh, the wolves have expressed to me that we put our entire trust in you, Mayor. Anything that you decide will be uh, respected by the wolves of winter. This is your town. You have handled this entire situation with uh, grace and finesse. If it is uh, Svan later that we are to arrest, we are in great support. If not, we will gather our supplies and leave as quickly as possible. Well, I'd like to thank you for that. I'd like to say something in that regard. I get nervous, so I'm going to look down at my speech. <laughs> Considering the patience and hard work of those who decided to join the Wolves of Winter and the continued patience and diplomatic manner that Carres has shown, we would like to now recognize the Wolves of Winter as an official guild of Evermore. Protecting it from those who attack its citizens. And in return, Evermore will do all it can to support the guilds. Svani is considered a threat and needs to be dealt with. I encourage all the guilds to join together now and protect our town. With pleasure. Arrest them. <coughs> Shall I call this meeting adjourned? Yes. Is the chamber opposed? Oh, yes. Sorry, I'm going to be opposed. I believe it is <laughs> Just so I will understands. say one thing before you go. I trust Bastion, and so I want you to, to be kind to him. He's about, I'm assuming, about to lose his brother. I would like to second this. The Wolves of Winter also recognize Sora and Bastion as allies. The target is von Leifer. Um, arrest or extradition? Professor. Yes. Well, you have to arrest them before you can extradite them. <laughs> That's usually how it works. <laughs> Given of what we know of what happened to the Ultra, um, what do you think we might be facing? Well, we're not entirely sure the extent of what Svani can do. My understanding is that he might pull something we've never seen on a scale we've never imagined before. So whatever we do, we need to approach this smart. We cannot rush him, we cannot be too aggressive, we never know what his reaction will be. And whatever he does, I'm not sure that we could stop it in time. So whatever, again, caution. No one make any sudden movements. I don't want to see what can happen if he fully unleashes what he's capable of. Ron, uh, I was saying that um, perhaps the knights go first and everyone else Mainly behind. Right. Given that the case, we don't want to endanger, or we want to endanger as few citizens of Edinburgh and guests and friends as possible. The knights will take the lead. <coughs> All right. Now, put that on. No, any opposed. <coughs> Shall I call this meeting adjourned? Short meeting. Very well. Seven forty-three. Meeting adjourned. Do we have a plan? <laughs> Gather your guilds. Perhaps don't discuss the plan in public where it might get to their ears. Go to your guilds and discuss it that way. Guild leaders, gather your men. Meet at the northern crossroads by the guillotine.